watching Let's Chat. You know, right here in Chattanooga, we have got a lot of great museums, really fascinating places that sometimes when you bring people in from out of town, you're looking for something to do, you kind of overlook them. You shouldn't do that. <laughs> Lily Waters is here to tell us about the big thing you guys have got going at the Houston Museum yeah. of Decorative Arts. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Five great museums plus one. Now I see here seven museums <laughs> yeah. set the record straight. That's right. What do we got? We've got the Medal of Honor Museum, mm -hmm. Six Calvary Museum, right. Tennessee Valley Railroad, Coker Car, the Towing Museum, Songbirds Guitar, and of course the Houston Museum of Decorative Arts. Yeah, the granddaddy of all the museums, <laughs> so to speak. And you guys have got something going on where you can tour all of those great places Absolutely. for one really inexpensive price. That's right. It's $25 mm -hmm. to view all seven museums, go in, experience those, explore those, and uh, it's a very good deal. You save over like $60. It's great. What made you guys decide to put this together? So, you know, as museums, we don't see as many locals, really, as we would like to have come in. Sure. Well, number one, it's just fun mm -hmm. to hold a museum hop. Right. Yeah. <laughs> but we really, I know at the Houston Museum, we'll see people from all over the nation, all over the world, right. come in. Like, just last week, um, we had somebody come through from England. Mm -hmm. And we, you know, see that more commonly than we actually do locals come in. So this is a way to just get the word out and tell the people of Chattanooga, hey, we've got some really great museums museums in the area that you need to come in and learn about and Yeah, and we certainly do. Yeah. And again, it's the International Towing and Recovery Hall of Fame and Museum, yeah. which is right across the street from us here on South Broad yeah. Street. A uh, beautiful and fascinating place. Sort of continuing that automotive theme, mm -hmm. uh, the Coker Car Museum, which yeah. the first time I went in there, it just blew me away. Coker Car is amazing. And I just found out recently they also have airplanes. Yes, they do. Yeah, I did not know that. That is amazing. Now, Lily said airplanes, plural. Is which it, means more than one. I think it is it yeah, two? Yeah, they've got uh, several in there. Oh, and okay. certainly parts yeah. of several other ones. Um, <laughs> I don't care if it's a car, truck, van, motorcycle, Motorcycles, what have yeah. you. It is in the Coker Car Museum. I know, it's really fascinating. And the beautiful thing about the Coker Museum is they're continually bringing in new vehicles, mm -hmm. taking other ones out, letting some rest, putting some new ones out yeah, on display. Yeah, exactly. Keeps it very fresh. Uh -huh. The uh, Coolidge Museum, tell me a little bit about that, the Medal of Honor. Medal of Center. Honor, yeah. I mean, it honors our heroes, recipients of, you know, the Medal of Honor. Um, you know, honors our military, mm -hmm. people who fought for our country. Certainly does. And they've got a lot of great stuff going on. So, I mean, I know when I walk through there, it's it's hard to not let the waterworks get you yeah, sometimes. Yeah, it really will. Yeah. I mean, it'll, it'll make your eyes tear up. It and definitely. It shivers up the spine. Definitely did for me. Everything so, uh, else. And uh, what the Coker Car Museum is to the automotive world, the Songbirds Guitar Museum oh goodness, is to the yeah. music world. Songbirds, have you been in there yet? Many times. <laughs> yeah. It's such a rare and fascinating collection mm -hmm. of just beautiful vintage guitars, unlike any other collection in the world. And you know, in the months leading up to when the Songbirds Museum opened up, we heard all the hype on it. Mm -hmm. And we thought, yeah, whatever. <laughs> sure, it'll be nice, but the first time you walk in there and you see the authentic it guitars, blows me away. not the replica guitars yeah. that your teenage <laughs> idol play right. the guitar. Yes, exactly. And, and several of those guitars in there are worth up north of a million dollars. Oh my goodness. Each. Each. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty uh, pretty amazing. And they hold, you know, concerts and stuff there as well. Mm -hmm. It's just an an all-inclusive, wonderful sure. package. And of course, the uh, Sixth Cavalry Museum, which uh, Chris runs and does a great job yeah. on, and the oh, yeah. Houston Museum of Decorative Arts, which you guys do, and you're always keeping it fresh as well. So how yeah. does this whole thing work? You have to buy a ticket. Yep. You're calling it a passport. It's a passport. So we have 200 available. Mm -hmm. You know, you go on Eventbrite, you get your ticket and you can get your passport at the first museum that you choose to visit right. and then as you go through each museum you'll get stamped you'll get a little little passport frog mm -hmm. stamp it's very fun Pretty cool <laughs> I, there are 200 of these available and you can only do the visiting by the way on the 15th and 16th yep, of Thursday august and friday right? so get out and show your support for the local museums you can get them individually you can get them for a family of four it doesn't matter all you have to do is get your tickets at eventbrite.com and then search for chattanooga hop trolley tour tickets chattanooga hop 
it'll get you there. Lily Waters, <laughs> thanks so much. Thank you so much for having you me. You see a spider over there. I'm <laughs> just, just kidding. Just kidding. Uh, stick around. We're going to be talking about some other great stuff coming up right around the corner. Stay with us right here on Let's Chat.